live. Morning guys. It is what about 6.30 in the morning. Sun's about to come up in a little bit. We're here in Arroyo City, Texas. Let's see if we can catch some speckled trout and some red. And my boy on some fish today. Uh, we'll give you guys some content right now, so stay tuned. guys we're here about 6 40 a.m. Um, we are in, what north of Bird Island working the shoreline we're gonna start off looks like a nice day I'm gonna throw some top water what do you think Eric flip it he's flipping it you're going for the flip I don't even know where your net is The black deal? I'll get it out. Oh, that's a nice trout, Eric. First trout right here of the day. It's pretty little healthy. I don't know, it's gonna be maybe about 17. 16 inches, seven, 16 and a half. He's seven. fat, he's fat. Nice little fatty. Good bite. Right on the shoreline over here. Uh, using a dark color chicken boy. I haven't used them in a while, but I decided to go with some chicken boy today, a little paddle tail using a red and black, and uh, it hit the bit really well, so hopefully there's more. Maybe just the earth, though, you really think, I'm not trying to show my... I, I just see so much inconsistency. Something that you can never see. Does not feel big. <laughs> think so? Yeah, 14. 14. I wonder if they want that, uh... For rip? You got nothing. Did you set the crap out of it, or it's actually pretty good fish? I don't know. I think he's decent. Skinny boy. Let me get him a little bit tired. Oh, came off. I see, that's about a 16 incher right there. Beautiful Texas sunrise. You got to make sure you hit those major feeding times. Like seven, six, six and a half. Six, seven. Give me the update. All right, guys. It's been 30 minutes, 45 minutes. We got uh, four in the box, uh, four trout. And we've seen a couple of mud boils that caught a little undersized red, so I'm thinking maybe there's some more reds up on that shoreline. What is the technique we're using? Guys, we're jigging. We're just jigging soft plastics. Different colors, a light, dark, I got a dark. And uh, so far everything's been hitting, but we'll see what, uh, let's see if we can pick up a pattern. Talk to me, Eric. Oh, no. Oh, that was a mullet. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I thought it was a little red. He's pretty innocent. Yeah, he did. Oh, look at that tail, dude. Go for the release. Is it bobbing? Yeah, bobbing. Oh, nice trout. Nice trout, Eric. Nice trout, Eric. Don't mess it up. It's a big trout. Oh! Oh! Rick coming in clutch! Coming in clutch, man! Saved by the net. Saved by the net. Oh, you would have killed me. Thank you, sir. All right, I just caught this bad boy right here. It's about 20 inches. Nice and healthy. He's still got some life in him. Using uh, dark colors, red, the same chicken boy, little red and black chicken boy, paddle tails. And uh, so far, it's just a good soft, soft little subtle hit. He's jigging. And, uh, and, he, and, he went for it. and right at the boat, man. That's why. Good, uh, good network. Good, good, good 
netting work <laughs> is important because uh, right as I got into the net, oof, he spit on the hook and, and I would have lost the battle with how it sucked. So, thank you, sir. Oh, he, it hadn't lodged in. It just... It was in there. I just literally just pulled it up him. And he never, he never let go of the side, so he never actually fell completely in. That's a bad hook set, son. All right, guys, that is another trout right there. I caught him on the AM lure. I don't even know what the color is. It's, uh, I think it's, it's like a pumpkin seed looking. Chicken, chicken chartreuse, I think. Chicken chartreuse. Um, yeah. Did, leading chicken. Maybe something like that. Didn't get a good hook set on him, but it's a nice, healthy trout we're finding here on the shoreline. So, let's get him a measure. That's a 17. He was working at his house. Oh, yeah, yeah. This Christmas, some guy was yeah, playing Yeah, but how like... high was he up? Dude, I remember one time, you freaking jerk. I was I was probably the most scared of him. And the thing is that I, I was I was going to fall flat on my face. I'm going to die. Now I'm thinking about it. Oh, I was looking at your dad. I got a hit. Huh? You also have a face, too. You think, man? I don't know. Rod weight feels heavy. Real weight feels light. He's staying down, son. He's doing that move. You know what I'm saying? Show yourself. Show yourself, son. What do you look like? Oh yeah. You gonna net it, Eric? You're just gonna look at me, son. You gonna pick it up? There it is. All right, guys. Throw in called a tiny little slurp and it was a uh, looks like it's about a 16 16 and a half inch trout we're catching them using the jigging method we're in the shoreline here i am using an am lure um, but it seems to be hitting on anything that is anybody that's jigging seems to be getting hits so yeah good fish we're trying to keep it uh keep it rolling I did not set the hook well. It doesn't feel huge. I did not set the hook well. Nice trout, dude. Nice though, huh? I mean, <laughs> we're getting big. All right, guys, we're just working the shoreline right here. We've been picking up some nice trout. I would say you're getting, you're probably getting for every keeper, you're, you're probably getting two keepers for every dink you're catching out here. Some quality trout. Um, like I said, we're still just jigging. Um, I'm using AM lures. We got a sandy bottom, you know, just working it, working it slow. And, uh, you know, trying to execute when we get a bite. Keep you all posted. You are? All right, guys. AM lure, atomic belly on the cork. Are you live, Eric? Yeah. Yeah, man, I lost a big one. You guys will see that on the video, but you will not see me catch this one because I my battery died. That is a nice trout. What you think, 18, 19? I think they were like 19. Yeah. Nice trout. All right, let's measure it. Wow. So if you're from Sabine, that's a gator. And I hate to tell you. Nice. Get a trout. But then, but then you you genuinely did spend the money then. Money you did, done. you did. But it makes it look like the company had expenses, and the comp that's a good fish, and the company broke even. No, that's not a Denzel. Tell him it's not a Denzel, sir. I saw it. I saw his rod bend in half. Oh, don't mess it up, sir. Woo! Let me scare it out. See, so, yeah, I scared it out though. That's a, that's actually a tactic. Oh, that's scary. 
14. I'm telling y'all, my this arm's getting tired. Let me measure it. No. That's 19 all day. Just put the little grip. Talk about it. Throw on the spoon. Again, drifting to another little shoreline. Just going to some nice shallow clear water. This is a Ryan Little production. to the house we had a good day finished the day off with 15 keeper trout four reds mainly was caught using the jigging method i was using am lures for the most part eric what'd you use chicken boy chicken boy lures yeah. and uh also caught some reds on the gold spoon it was a good day to say the least feels good to get back on the fish for a day y'all stay tuned for another episode of fishing with rick <laughs>